guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are a new subscriber, thank you so much for subscribing. If you're not, go ahead and hit the subscribe button. I release videos once or twice a week once or twice a year. I release videos once or twice a week covering a wide variety of topics. So today we're talking about spring. Today it's all about spring fashion. I have been looking forward to spring. It seems as though it's not springtime yet because it's still cold outside. I'm still wearing a sweater, but I know it's coming. I feel it in the air. It's like 30 degrees now, well no, it's 40 degrees now. And I think next week it's gonna slowly creep up to like 50 degrees. So absolutely, hopefully by the time I upload this video, spring will be here and it will be in full force. So I have a couple of items that I got online that I want to share with you with regard to spring trends. But before then, take a step back. For me, spring is not just all about getting new clothes and you know getting rid of old clothes. It's also all about you know a new beginning. Honestly, trying to figure out what the new season is going to have in store for you. And as far as the home is concerned, I love 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 having new fragrances. I love having spring fragrances at home that reflect you know the new season. And I stopped by Joe Malone at Macy's the other day to pick up a couple of items candles and perfume that I'm going to share with you today just you know in the spring spirit so it will be a combination of Jo Malone home candles and Jo Malone scents you know home spring rejuvenation if you will and clothes as well so let's go ahead and get started <sighs> it's a big box quite sturdy and I have my tried and trusted and true knife here with me okay now that that's done Open up the bar, get this part out, get that part out. This is a huge Joe Malone bag. Oh, my receipts here. Okay. Oh, first things first samples. So, what do I have in here? Lime Basil and Mandarin Body and Hand Wash. Oh, so it's not a hand cream, it's actually a body wash. Okay, I like that. And the same, oh, this is the body cream. So this is the body wash and this is the body cream. All right, I definitely will check it out. I tried the Lime and Basil fragrance and it wasn't my thing, but my favorite candle right now is the Basil and Neroli. So I like the Basil undertones, definitely. So being that this is Lime and Basil, I'll check it out and see how I feel about it. So, so we have the body cream and the body wash. All right, and then a couple of samples, about five of them. This is English oak and red currant cologne. Pomegranate noir cologne. I think I like this, I like this fragrance. Red roses, I love red roses and I love the fragrance actually. So red roses and let's see. Oh, gray and cucumber cologne, okay nice and fresh and she, I told her what I was looking for I wanted something you know spring related springtime vibey so I'll definitely check that out I can put that here for now no. all right so what do we have here we have Joe hope you can focus hope it's able to catch I don't know if the light's catching it maybe it is maybe it's not okay but I'm going to open this now the bow right here, so gorgeous. Nice, sturdy black back and paper. Nice, sturdy black back and paper. Oh, I think this see where she put it because when I went over there I didn't feel like carrying it all the way back to New York it was late at night and um, I think I have that in my other vlog so I decided to have her mail everything that way I can have it in a package and I just won't ruin the packaging so this is another sample bag this is the cutest little sample bag ever it's like a miniature bag because it has the same bow it has the same pattern same design oh my god It's all about client relationship, guys. 
if you let them know you know the products, you like the products, you're interested in the product, and they see that in you, they want a paying customer, they want a loyal customer. It's easier for a loyal customer to make a purchase than a random customer, and they understand that. So that's why brands who understand client relationship management always get my vote. So what is this? This is a body wash, basil and neroli. This is the one I have at home. So this is the body wash of it. Oh, it smells so good, guys. It smells so good. And then this is Blackberry and Bay Cologne. Okay, okay, okay. And what more do we have here? Oh, this is going definitely in my purse. Mimosa and cardamom. Oh my god. Body cream, so tiny, but so compact. Probably this is going to be at my desk at work. Oh yeah, totally, I'm taking this with me. My bag, no, it's probably my desk. It would be better suited at my desk at work. So that's what I got as far as samples. That's a lot because I got three samples in here and then I got four um, little mini fragrances and body wash and one hand lotion. So that's a lot. In total, that's probably about, let's see. Four, yeah, four plus two, six, 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 three, nine. I got nine, nine little gifts. Amazing. Alrighty. Now what do we have here? See, classic Jim Malone box with the bow. Almost never like unboxing, honestly, because it's just so sad when you open the package. Okay, so I got, this is for Ray. This is his, um, because I just got another fragrance from Chanel, which I will share with you guys later. But this is Oris and Sandalwood. As you can see, it's masculine, it's the masculine kind. It smells so good, super duper masculine, super duper fresh, super duper springtimey. So I know he's excited, he, he's into his colognes, he knows more about colognes than I do. More, I wear a lot of perfume, he wears even a lot more, like a significantly amount more than I have. Sometimes it's like, what do I feel like smelling like today? Creed or YSL? I'm like, I don't know, something nice. Anyway, so that's that. And then what else do I have in here? Oh, well this just came out. Bummer. But anyway, you can see. What am I going to do with all these boxes? I don't want to throw them away, but they're so cute. Open. This is definitely my steve. And I have two miniature candles. Because I couldn't decide and I didn't want to just buy one big one. I wanted both, so I decided to get two small ones. That way I could, you know, switch my style up if needed. But they're so cute. So this is peony and blush suede. Again, flowers, floral, springtime fresh, and red roses. I think they make great accents in the home. I'm actually also probably gonna pick up a few more for my bridal shower, just to have them on the table. I feel like they are amazing. They're nice to the touch of luxury to your home, to your event, to your office. And if you're traveling, you can also take them with you. They're the perfect travel compact size. So if your home smells like Jim Malone, which mine does, and you're traveling and you, wherever you, you know, going to be for a couple of days to smell like home, just get one of these travel size candles and take them with you. So yeah, as far as the home, I got these for the home, and I'm probably going to get a little more in the next couple of weeks. And uh, as far as fragrances, Ray has the new fragrance, which is exciting. And then I got a lot of samples, which is so cool. So thank you so much, Joe Malone, for putting this all together. Well, at least for the samples. This is not a sponsored video, guys. But still, I share my content with you so you can see how I honestly feel about certain brands and the brands that I like and the brands that I feel have great relationship management and Joe Malone is one of them. Okay, so what do I have next? So this is Maybelline New York a lip gloss. It's actually a matte lip gloss, and it's you know very mauvey, dusty rose pink kind of lip gloss. I have one like this from Revlon, and while I liked it for a while, I felt like after a while it started leaving residues on my lip area, so I stopped using it. But I got this as a sample when I ordered something from Mula Lai a couple of weeks ago. So it's a color 6 to 5 Seductress. So if you want to check it out, Maybelline Super Stay Matte Ink. That's what I have on my lip right now and so far so good. I did put a little gloss over it because I like my glossy finish. But 
it's springtime color, so if you're considering a new springtime color, I recommend you check Maybelline's new Superstay Matte Ink family. They do have a couple of good products. Because after getting this, I looked online and I saw the other products that they have, and they're pretty cool. Hi, everybody. So this is from Venus. <laughs> Venus guys, you know I love my Venus, right? Okay. They always have one sale or the other going on and the other day I was looking around and I found out that they had a couple items that I liked. So I thought to, you know, hit the purchase button because it's springtime and you know you need a new set of clothes for a certain activities. So this is my invoice and everything I get comes with a return label and a catalog which I always take with me because I look through the catalog on my way to work or on my way back from work that way I feel like I don't miss anything and I'm in the know with all the new arrivals so first I have here I think this is just a simple white dress I have this dress in black and I have it in olive so sleeveless simple white dress but I think it's so chic my size is extra small because it, you know, it's very form-fitting and it's ruched and it's, it hugs you basically. So it's very easy. You can style it up. You can style it down. No frills. Very classic, simple, springtime fresh. You can wear it to brunch. You can wear it just for shopping. You can wear it just to hang out. Whatever it is. Now it does require you to be in shape though. So if you have a little extra, you know in the belly area or in the back area, I do. You have to probably work out before you wear this dress so make sure you have like tight inner garments to put everything in place. The second dress, oh my god, I stalked this dress for a long time. First time I saw it was like in October and it wasn't available yet. It was back ordered to like March or something and then it became available. It reminds me of a combination of Balmain and Versace and you see why. It's blush. One of my favorite colors, as you guys know already. And it's pretty structured. It's off the shoulder. Simple, but then it has some classic buttons over here. Oh my god, I didn't realize it was this short. But yeah, it's stunning. And it has the detail, the same button details at the back. And I ordered a size 8. I'm usually size 6, but being that it's a tight dress, I know Venus sometimes sizes up for the tight dresses and size down for their baggy clothes. Does that make sense? For example, if I'm buying a shirt from Venus that's supposed to be oversized, I'll buy extra small. But if I'm buying a fitted dress, I would probably buy a size 8 as opposed to size 6 because size 6 probably would be too small. Remember the last dress I got from my bridal shower, which I just exchanged and I really just got it back the other day. It was a size 6 and it was too small, so I got a size 8 which is perfect and it's very similar to this dress. So here, I love the gold detail, the gold you know, button, the gold zip. It's just very classic, very chic, very Balmani, very versace -y, if you will. So. I'm excited to try this out. I'm excited to see what it's going to look like on me. And then this is a classic white dress. I have a few white dresses, but I feel like I can use them for different reasons. And this is one of those that I can wear for anything. I feel like I can wear this dress on the boat. I can wear this dress to brunch. I can wear this dress to a friend's party. It's just very simple and straightforward. It's an oversized dress shirt with a belt. The material actually is thicker than I thought it would be. I thought it would be maybe more like, like a linen material, but this actually is cotton. So it's straightforward and it's kind of like high-low at the bottom and it's cut out here with this brown belt details. It'll be very perfect for honeymoon, very perfect for brunch, very perfect for hanging out with friends. And being that this dress has a large fitting, I got it in extra small. So I will try on these clothes and let you know how they worked out for me. But for now, definitely this is a good staple if you're trying to just have something that you can use all through spring and all through summer and through like some early parts of fall as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I thought to share with you my springtime fashion and home haul featuring Jo Malone and Venus. Um, these are brands that I use all the time. I love the candles, I love the fragrances, and I'm going to be smelling like them. If you see me on the street, you can always approach me and be like, hey Annette, can I smell you? Can I smell you? Do you have the Jo Malone fragrance on? And I'll be like, yep, I do. But just don't be worried about it though. 
and um, yeah and then these clothes are going to be heavily featured in my vlog I don't anticipate doing a lot of more shopping for spring because I have a lot of things that I wore last year and I'm still going to wear this year I just felt like I needed a couple of new pieces here and there to accentuate my fall 2018 wardrobe and that's precisely what I did so thanks for hanging out with me today guys if you're not subscribed to my channel yet go ahead and hit the subscribe button I would really really appreciate it also if you gave this video a nice huge resounding thumbs up thanks for watching guys and I'll catch you guys in my next video bye